Hi friends, this is Rishabh Kapoor from websofttutorials.com. In this tutorial, guys, we will download a text editor and we will create our first HTML template. So, guys, firstly, we will download a text editor. To download a text editor, firstly, we will go to google.com and in the Google search bar, we will type the name of the text editor. We will type Notepad++. Guys, in this video series, we are going we are going to use Notepad++, which is a free of cost text editor and it is a very good text editor for the beginners. So we will click on download Notepad++ plus plus link and the Notepad++ plus plus website will be opened. On the left side you can see different different versions of Notepad++ plus plus are available. But we will download the latest one which is 6.2.2 and after pressing the download button the downloading will begin automatically. Yeah, You can see save file. So after pressing the save file the downloading will begin but I will stop this because it is already installed into my computer so after installing it open notepad plus plus document guys this is just a blank blank document this is not an HTML document to make it a HTML document firstly we will save it with dot HTML or dot HTML extension press control s but it is not working because this is a blank document to save it we have to write something in notepad plus plus we can write anything like a or s or something any key after pressing control s a dialog box will be appear so we can save it first dot html so save it now you can say this is a html document guys this is a html document but we can't write it like this because as i told you before that html is a markup language it is written in tags so we can't can't write it like this so we have we have to write it everything you write everything inside tags to make tags firstly we will use a less than sign a greater than sign and in in between these greater than and less than greater than sign we will type the name of our tag we can type any name like h1 tag p tag it depends upon your requirement which tag you want to use so first tag is doc type doc type html as from the name you can come to know that it is telling that this is this document type is html it helps the browsers to understand that this is an html document so after that we will type html guys this is opening tag of html and if we are opening any tag then we have to close it using forward slash html as you can see greater than uh, less than sign a forward slash and same name html and a greater than sign this is a opening tag this is a closing tag all the html is written in between these tags it is showing that the HTML document is starts from this tag and and from this tag. So, guys, HTML document is divided into two parts: a header part and a body part. If you will open the browser and uh, whatever will be shown in the browser, it is it is written in body part. And in the head part, we will type title, meta tags, which is uh, used for page ranking, web page ranking. Uh, by using search engine optimization and uh, we, uh, if we want to include any external CSS file in this HTML we will write their link or uh, source in head part so we will type head part and we will close it using forward slash we will type title title tag is also used inside head part Guys, uh, firstly I will run it in inside my browser. Guys, you can see there is no title is showing. It is not showing any title. It is showing just the location of my HTML document, like see users top HTML first or HTML. But I want title to be shown in this document. So websofttutorials.com now if I will refresh it and now you can see websofttutorials.com so guys if we want to 
include any external CSS file or JavaScript file or we, if we want to write CSS or JavaScript we can write it inside these text but I, I will teach you these things in, uh, in later tutorials now we will come to body section close opening tag and closing tag guys this is also a feature of notepad plus plus after double click on it it will show that the opening and closing tags of HTML everything will be which will be shown in this document we have to write in in body tag so I will write I am Rishab Kapoor from web so dot com so I feel if I will refresh it you can see I am Rishab Kapoor from com. I have written it it's showing but as I told you before I have to write everything in tags so this is the wrong way to write it so so this is a wrong way to write it so in the next tutorial I will teach you something uh, about tags so thanks for watching this video guys let's see in the next tutorial